we're building an EXSI server today. We're gonna build it here in this case that I have. It's a Corsair 200R. This is gonna be our virtual cloud platform. EXSI lets you have virtual SANS, which is a storage and virtual networks. Uh, we're gonna, this is gonna be a budget build, so we're gonna have uh, this uh, budget uh, motherboard with an i5 uh, Intel processor. We also want to max out the capacity of the motherboard with RAM. In this case, it's only 32 gigs. So we put 32 gigs of RAM in this motherboard, and we also going to uh, update and upgrade our network capabilities so we can have uh, numerous virtual machines running at the same time and not have a bottleneck in our network capacity. Uh, so we're going to put this quad port uh, NIC card on it, which is one gig uh, each port. And, uh, we need a power supply also. Uh, I know it's kind of a overkill at 600 watts, but that's the only one that I have laying down that I can utilize for, for this build. Now we're gonna go and go to the BIOS and make sure that uh, the BIOS is uh, capable to run the virtualization. So we wanna make sure that the virtualization is uh, turned on, enabled in the motherboard, and that our memories are fully recognized and our NIC card is also recognized. EXSI server, this is going to be the 6.0 uh, version and it's going to go through the initialization uh, process and then we're going to take it in another video and I want to take you step by step on the uh, configuration, the first configuration in order to get that. Uh, here we are configuring the network. Uh, just to make sure that we can uh, reach it over a, uh, a browser, so the, the, the rest, of not a browser, um, the C v -Spear tool, so we can then connect to the server and, and finish the configuration. That's all for now, have a great day and I'll see you next, bye.